Right, a very, very lovely book we have got our hands on here. An early copy of the Neo Geo of Visual History. Here you see it in all its sealed glory. Of course, like anything beautiful, the thing to do is to unseal it so you can have a proper look. But um, this is the pre unsealed view of it. So it was very nicely delivered and wrapped to us. Um, just taking you through SNK Future is now official licensed product and the SNK gold logo there which is uh, nicely finished you see there Neo Geo a visual history just track back and even the logo there a Neo Geo a visual history now this is by Bitmap Books and really the thing now is to get it open and uh, pull out some highlights of this amazing new book from Bitmap Books. So, taking the seal off is always a quite an exciting part to getting any product, a book, a console, a game. And there it is, taking that off. You can see just that amazing artwork there. And lovely um, reproduction and colours. So I'm not going to show you every page because I think um, this is just a overview because you're going to want to have a look at it yourself. Um, but yeah, just taking you through some of the book. Look at that artwork, absolutely stunning book cover. And sometimes, you know, you just need to show a beautiful image. Don't need to say a lot and that just sums it up very nicely. Wow, look at that as an opening double page spread really lovely the future is now gives you an overview of uh, how it all came about now forgive me I'll uh, try and pronounce some of these names but some seminal people have contributed to this book this is uh, Yutaka Noguchi and he was a director of SNK, or is the director of SNK Gaming Division. And uh, as I say, this is the official SNK Neo Geo book, which is published by Bitmap Books. So, giving some introduction there to the book. And wow, look at that. Ooh, that is really nice. That gold, absolutely stunning. You can see that. The repro on that is amazing. And it contrasts very nicely to the uh, to the black on the uh, opposite side. Some really beautiful uh, finishing there on the printing side. Uh, so this takes you through the early years, as it says there, 73 to 89. I'm just going to pick some select pages. So this kind of gives you a bit of an early overview, which is really nice. Look at that art. Wow. Kari Free again gives you an overview of the 90s to 2004. Quite a lot of editorial copy that is amazing. The MVS art, look at that. Anybody who appreciates any kind of uh, vintage classic gaming will uh, love that, but particularly Neo Geo fans, you can see that. As I say, I'm not going to try and uh, cover the whole thing, I'm just going to very carefully flick through it as an MVS tablet with the uh, Neo Geo backlit logo. I mean, literally, you can see that how stunning that is. So, I pick up another sort of spread here. This is an MVS kit, beautiful photography. That's Garo Mark of the Wolves. I'm sure, some of you guys immediately recognize that. I'm really just going to focus on some of the photography here. Um, and try not to get any pages uh, with any thumbprints on. Should really be wearing gloves for this. Some component photography, so it's really taking you through some of the uh, detail, the iconic aspects of um, what Neo Geo is about. Obviously, there's the games, but you've got memory card uh, artwork there, the actual console artwork, really going into massive detail. Uh, the control system, or uh, sorry, the yeah, I think uh, it's the controller, it's another control, the deck there, the amusement system. Some things here people might not have seen. Um, 
and uh, I won't spoil it, but there's um, there's a reason for a lot of this photography. There's a fantastic collaboration here on the collection side. I think um, some of you guys might know that already, but again, this book is about you finding out about um, really what's behind this story. Let's skip forward, right? Let's get into some of the games. Super Sidekicks, brilliant! I love that game. Such a playable football or soccer game. And uh, so, look at the artwork there, really beautiful. Let's just skip through. King of Fighters 95, I mean, what a title to land on. I'll just read that out. From one iconic shot to another, main protagonist. <laughs> I won't try the pronunciation. Shows off his signature flames in a relatively simple piece. Shinkiro's art shines through yet again and was used extensively to advertise this blockbuster title. Ninja Masters, beautiful game. Really addictive as well. Metal Slug, I mean, I thought, I wonder when we were getting into Metal Slug, so uh, there it is. It's one of the uh, many games which uh, is part of real gaming history there. Let's flick forward a bit. So you've got some original kind of drawings there, which sketch drawings, penned up drawings, coloured up character concept art. Um, then you've got some art pieces from the uh, screenshots from the games. So say you've got packaging, art, it's kind of concept art, which let's just get that very gently, carefully. We saw there, look at that. So it's Gary Mark of the Wolves, that's uh, a sub boss. And you've got game art, art of fighting, just pull back there, can you see that? So I don't want to show every spread, I think this is for you to experience it all. I'm just going to show a few more bits. I mean, it's, I knew there were things like this, there's the Neo Geo Club newsletter, so it really goes into some nice detail, a variety of different pieces. Um, some letters there from the fanzine, taking it beyond the Neo Geo Entertainment aspect. I don't know too much about that so I want to read a bit more. Look at that. I saw that recently. Uh, come up with a data discs issue of uh, Metal Slug. The later years. I'm not going to spoil that. I think that's one to find out. And um, I expect at the end they've got some credits here. So the people who help put this together uh, Fraser Rhodes, who uh, we're going to meet very soon at Play Expo, uh, Brian Hargrove, and Massimo Molino Macri, who have um, checked and scanned and researched over the last year. Steve Jarrett did the writing and editing, and a number of other people you can see. She's a, an army of people who have put this beautiful book together. Um, and yeah, we're very impressed by it. I so say this is just an overview of the book. I don't want to uh, spoil it too much for everybody, but. I'd say overall, if you want a complete saga of Neo Geo, um, and also a high quality book, I mean, look at the actual reproduction here of the artwork, it's beautiful, it's a very nice big book to have in your collection, uh, I think an absolute coffee table must for any retro game collector, and if you're a Neo Geo fan, I, I expect you're going to know a lot more than I am about these books but um, I mean, look at this beautiful um, spread on the pocket I had this one here um, and yeah look at that so I'm just going to close the back fantastic book um, definitely going to read it in a lot of detail um, and uh, just wanted to give you an unboxing and overview hope you enjoyed it